Hey man, what's up? It's midday on Thursday, I think it is today. Just struggling to understand my artificial intelligence practical 2 at the moment. I've been brainstorming some things, just trying to understand the back property. It's on genetic, genetic algorithms, which is really cool, and kind of simulating the evolution of different things, uh, of different um, individuals in order to create like an optimal solution. So that's kind of cool. And the theory is quite simple and like understanding it, I've, I've got it down, but just implementing it in the framework that they want us to do it in, in a kind of rock, paper, scissors game, I'm just struggling to integrate it into that. In my mind, uh, the concept in that is pretty simple and if it, you were just doing it by yourself and you could evaluate it afterwards, it would be cool. But integrating it with a game of rock, paper, scissors is just taking me some time at the moment. So I've been <laughs> trying to understand how shit works. Um, needing an output of 81 genes for the depth of search history based on the data they're giving us in a CSV file, uh, creating a fitness function to evaluate each individual and its genetic um, potential to win the match of rock, paper, scissors, and then later on mutating the different genes together in order to get a more optimal solution to a selection of rock, paper, scissors moves and games and that, and splicing individuals, <sighs> you know. Um, so yeah, so that's, that's what I'm up to right now. It's Thursday today. I have a couple of class tests tomorrow, and then this practical due on Monday, and Eng Week starting on Monday. I haven't started studying for Eng Week yet, so I'm a bit stressed about that. <sighs> but yeah, let me get back to work. Sorry these vlogs haven't been super interesting recently, but that's just uh, the name of the game, eh? I finished actually reading um, the book about SpaceX this morning, the liftoff book that just recently got published about the early days of SpaceX and the startup history and that, and it just motivated me and inspired me so much, because like... That was some real engineering that they did out there on the island in the middle of the Pacific Ocean, building the Falcon 1 rocket that then went on to influence the development of the Falcon 9, the Falcon Heavy, and now the Starship that's going to take people to Mars. Like, amazing what a couple of engineers can do with a couple of years and a couple million dollars, um, and just insane amounts of hard work. So it's motivating me to, to learn a bit more and to work a bit harder. Maybe I should definitely go into rocket science, hey? Seems to be very interested in it, although it's more mechanical engineering, but I can learn that stuff. Um, just read a few rocket propulsion textbooks. But yeah, no, it was a really good book, and I really enjoyed uh, reading it. I'm still reading The Singularity is now, or listening to it whenever I have a, a spare second while I'm driving by myself and I can listen to audiobooks. Uh, yeah, that's what's going on. My brain has been all over the place with practicals recently. Let me get back to it and hopefully regain some sense of composure. Hey, what's up? It is Friday night. Um, I'm about to just have some dinner, but the practice and that are going okay. I'm busy writing out with my group my Computer Engineering Architecture Practical 1 report. It's due at midnight tonight, and it is currently 20 to 8, and it's nowhere near done. But we've made some good progress today, and I'm going to do some more hard work on it after dinner. Um, then just gonna. I wrote, oh, I wrote two class tests today that went kind of okay. Computer engineering architecture was fine. I was just working out some calculations for some mock computer systems and um, basically analyzing the performance and doing a bit of theory questions and that. And then for uh, electromagnetism, there was a question on bounce diagrams, uh, which is basically a visual way of showing um, the voltage changes over a transmission line as time goes on. I didn't know what a bounce diagram was until the test, until 20 minutes into the test, and I read the textbook, because I haven't watched the lectures this week, because I've been so busy with the cracks. But I think I did, did well, and I think it went okay, which is great. And so I've just been working on the prac for the rest of the day. Going to work on the AI prac for Monday this whole weekend, and actually study for end week this weekend, and hopefully chill a little bit. But probably not the, sec but probably not the last one. Okay, let me get to eat dinner and get back to work. Look how nice my fish tanks and my tomato plant is. Green thumb. Mm. Yum, yum. What's up? Saturday morning, just grafting on the AI textbook. Actually, just trying to read through it and understand some stuff for my test on Monday. I've got to work on the practical two on genetic algorithms later, but I'm trying to focus on the textbook so far. I watched some lectures this morning that I hadn't watched. 
um, and so I understand um, the local optimized search a bit better. So that's good. It's damn cold today. Uh, winter is hopefully on the way. I'm actually looking forward to it. It's nice to have a change. We didn't have a particularly hot summer, but it's always nice to go from heat to uh, there's a fire out there. Huh. To go from heat to cold and back to heat. I like the change of seasons. Back to work. Ugh. What's up, vlog? I'm just feeling really exhausted right now. And Andrew hasn't even started yet, bruh. Ah. That's always what um. Well, students can tell you. Uh, the week before end week is actually the most stressful week and the week that leaves you feeling the most tired because all your practicals are due. I'm busy just trying to read through the AI textbook and understand some stuff that's going on. I'm busy learning about adversarial search and uh, stochastic search and some interesting ways of solving problems, um, which is interesting. Stereotypical gym boy outfit today. Oh, TD? Come on. I thought you have to use use the leg extension machine for glute bridges. Let's see how much it goes. <laughs> Looks like you're doing that weird dog. <laughs> Yes. Uh, good morning. It's it's Monday morning today, right? Yeah, it's Monday morning. I have my AI semester test today. It's my first semester test for this week. It's end week. I'm a bit stressed. Hey, there's a bird. Um, yeah, I got end week this week, so I'm gonna be crafting my ass off. Also got an EAI EAI prac due this evening that I haven't finished yet. It's a lot going on. I see UCT is busy burning down. The one library is already burnt down uh, due to like an errant felt fire going there on the side of the mountain. Crazy times. Hope everyone is alright and that uh, university kind of moves on and that and you guys get all the support you need. That really sucks. And yeah, let's, uh, let's crush the week. It's good. It's about 25 past 1. Just finished my AI semester test. It went really well. I don't know about the copyright uh, problems of this, but I'm going to show it over here. Um, so it was mostly just drawing out graphs. We had to do an alpha beta tree, which I learned how to do properly yesterday. Uh, we had to do an A star tree with a heuristic function, which went well. And then there was also a question on safely explorable graphs. And I think it was a uniform cost search. Yeah, I think so. I don't know. I, I wrote my stuff down. I think it did really well. Um, time to have some lunch and work on this prac. Yeah. Out on an afternoon run. Whew. Halfway through the run. Been a productive day. Don't have anything else to say. <sighs> that rhymed, didn't it? <laughs> <laughs> 